name is Little Amal, although there is nothing little about her. At 12 feet tall, Little Amal is a puppet who represents a 10-year-old Syrian refugee in search of her mother. What an incredible journey that Little Amal is on. Amal's story resonates with many immigrants today who are displaced and trying to find a new home. They're dumping the people like a garbage, and I don't think that's fair. I think we are here to help each other, and everybody is welcome to come here. If we can help, we're going to do it. I'm as an immigrant. Mm -hmm. I came here 20 years ago, but it's still, I feel, I, I feel like, you know, those emotions, right? Um, and that little girl represents us as an immigrant, right? And... Um, being here for me is like welcoming all the little kids that are coming right now. Amal arrived in New York City last week. She traveled from Turkey to Britain last year and is now here as part of the Little Amal Locks New York City project. Little Amal represents all the children around the world that have been displaced by war, by violence, by climate change. More than half of the world's refugees and immigrants are children under the age of 18. Little Amal wants to remind us all that that is the truth. How are we taking care of all of those children who are just looking for a safe place to live? In a ceremony this morning, participants blessed a garden with sage, and then Amal herself, before she began her journey from Aleppo to search for her family. There was also room to celebrate in times of sorrow with people dancing with Amal in the street. Little Mall comes at a time when thousands of migrants are arriving in New York City to seek asylum. This week, five migrant buses arrived in New York City as Mayor Eric Adams constructs a tent city in the Bronx for asylum seekers. Today is just one of Little Mall's 17 day tour through New York. She will continue to visit all five boroughs through October 2nd, making a whopping total of 55 stops. In Corona, Queens, I'm Treasure Lewis, New York City News Service.